Welcome, my friends, to Mario Kart 8 Deluxe's Booster Course Pass DLC Wave 3. That is a very long title. We're going to be going through the, uh, the different cups here in this video. I'm going to be doing one cup in this video and then the second cup in a different video just so you guys can actually see what each cup has to offer. It's going to be kind of more like walkthrough format, if you will. We've been doing this with every single, um, you know, brand new DLC that's come out so far. So I hope you guys do enjoy this one. If you do, be sure to stick around for more do variety of Nintendo based content here on this channel, uh, whether it's Nintendo news or gameplays or different things like that. So let's go over to the booster course pass uh, section here which would be right here. So again, at the uh, the first uh, wave was, uh, was what was these two right here, right? Was it? And then we had this, no, sorry, I'm getting it wrong. It was these two for the first wave, these two for the second wave. And now for the third wave, we have these two right here. So again, if you wanna see any of these previous ones, we've already covered those in a previous video. But today we're gonna to be covering the Rock Cup and in the next video, I'll be covering the Moon Cup. So in the Rock Cup, we got London Loop, Boo Lake, Rock Rock Mountain and Maple Treeway. So if you guys are ready for this, let's go ahead. I'm not going to waste any time. We're going to jump into this and uh, yeah, I'm going to be doing this at 150cc. Yes, I know 200cc is, is available, but I'm not good at 200. So <laughs> I feel like 150 is kind of a nice middle ground, right? It's very fast paced. Um, we're going to be flying through these. Uh, we're going to be flying through these tracks. We're going to be able to get a little bit of a look, a little bit of a, you know, some look at uh, some of the gameplay. If you don't have Nintendo Switch Online, then of course, uh, well, specifically uh, the expansion uh, pack version, uh, <clears throat> then you may not have free access to this. But if you do have Nintendo Switch Online uh, expansion pack, then you can get these uh, this DLC for free. But if you don't have it for free and you're wondering, you know, hey, is, is it worth it? Is it worth um, buying? Well, that's what these videos are here for, so you guys can see the gameplay, or if you just maybe curious to see some gameplay of the new maps. Okay, okay, okay. I'm pretty sure, whatever. Anyways, let's, um, so London Loop, where was London Loop from again? I just looked at it, and I already forgot. I'm a very forgetful person. Anyways, either way, the map's nice. The map is quite, ooh. We got, th ah, that was a waste. Oh, I was trying to hit the double. It's trying to hit the double. There we go. Got a red shell. Nice. All right. We're going to win. So far, we've had a perfect track record in all these DLC packs, by the way. Each time a pack has come out, uh, we've had a perfect re record of getting first place. Ah. Uh, first place. Not, maybe not first place in every single track, but overall. Like, you know, getting gold, the gold cup for the Grand Prix. For some reason... Though, when we were scrolling through it, it was showing as if, uh... Ooh, that was close. It was showing as if one of the, um... <clears throat> I think one of the first Grand Prix, as if I didn't do it. Which, I don't get why, because I definitely did it. I definitely did. Anyways. Alright, there's some, like, shortcuts here, man. I, I think. Is there shortcuts? I don't know. There's gotta be short... There's always... There's, oh, wow. <sighs> gotta love it as soon as you get items. As soon as you get your item... It's always like that, isn't it? So I was like, yep, yeah, just like those red shells or those blue shells right when you're at the finish line. That was a red shell. Oh my gosh, dude, these savages, man. <clears throat> Excuse me, what is happening right now? All right, it's okay. We're gonna get this. Oh, there's the blue shell. You know what? It worked out perfectly. Oh, wow. <clears throat> Never mind. Never, whoa, 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 Mario. Silver Mario, to be exact, but still, still Mario. Ah, no, dude, come on. What? Okay, we got this, we got this, we got this. Ah, dude, <clears throat> we're getting close to the finish line here. Oh, no, yes, yes, perfect, perfect. Oh, did they have a bomb? Is that what happened? Dude, I can't see, man. I can't see. Oh, boy. Let me know for future reference. Would you guys... Do you guys want these without face cam or, or with face cam? What do you guys... Do you have a... I don't know. I don't know if you guys have, like, a preference. I like doing them usually with, without because then... You can see the gameplay without, you know, any kind of obstructions. Anyways, we got first place <clears throat> for the first tra map, track, uh, whatever you want to call it. We can move on to the next one.
the next race. I think it's uh, it's the what is it? Boo Boo Lake. Boo Lake. Yeah, this one's nice. Game Boy Advance. This one is from the Game Boy Advance. I didn't actually own a Game Boy Advance, so I don't know this this track personally, uh, to be honest. But I do love a spooky track, if I do say so myself. So I'm uh, very excited about this one. Let's go ahead and win another race. Hopefully, <laughs> hopefully, maybe I shouldn't say that. I feel like mess myself over. It's always the things you say that backfiring. Oh, this music is cool, man. Listen to that. Oh, we're going underwater? Okay. I didn't know that. That's interesting. Whoops, whoops. Come on, tight turns. Alright. Yeah, I love this music. <clears throat> it gives me like very like Super Nintendo vibe. I mean, the Game Boy Advance is pretty old, so... I guess so am I, man. So am I. You know that... Like, that's the beautiful thing, though. If you were born in the 80s or the 90s... Then, you know, or I guess earlier. But I, I feel like 80s and 90s was like the prime... Um, the prime uh, time for, you know... Being like super immersed in these games. Then it's like you've, you've got to experience... <coughs> Each generation, uh, as they were. Ooh, there we go. There we go. Let's just hold this in the back. Oh boy! Yeah, I went. Okay, there was a smooth run up until that point. Oh my gosh! Oh, I'm, I'm gonna get hit. Really? No, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. We're on the third lap, right? All right. Oh, blue shell. No. Oh, it hit me. I was trying to slow down, dude. Oh, I went off the edge. Come on. Come on. What is happening here? We had such a smooth run. Oh, no. Fourth place, bro. <coughs> Excuse me. That is bad. That is bad, dude. We were... Oh, my goodness. I think I need, like, <coughs> first place for both of these. Because if I don't get first place for both these, I don't I don't know. Metal Mario, man, he's got that little advantage. Alright, so this is going to be uh, Rock Rock Mountain from the 3DS. 3DS was such a great console. Oh my goodness. Alright. Here we go. Yeah, I don't know, man. The 3DS, I still think, is one of the greatest consoles that ever came out. It had, like, some of the best games. I mean, come on. We had, like, just for Zelda... Just for Zelda, we had, uh, listen, Triforce Heroes had a lot of potential, and I still think they should bring it to the Nintendo Switch uh, at some point, or, you know, remake it or, or something, because I think, you know, I think it would work well on Nintendo Switch, and it would be a perfect way to sell more Nintendo Switch online. Nintendo should hire me. <laughs> um, no, but, it, you know, it was okay. It was okay. <clears throat> um, but we had, you know, A Link Between Worlds, which was a great game. I think. I loved it. Um, we had Ocarina of Time 3D, basically the closest thing we ever got to a remake, or remaster. Uh, and the Majora's Mask <clears throat> 3D, which was beautiful. That, that game was just beautifully done, man. It uh, had some quality of life improvements, graphically looked great. I really wish they'd make HD versions of those for like the Switch or whatever comes next. <clears throat> but we still don't even have Twilight Princess HD or Wind Waker HD on the Nintendo Switch, so I don't know. Maybe those are never going to happen at this point, who knows. But anyways, a lot, of, a lot of great Zelda stuff, and then we had a bunch of Mario, man. We had like 3D, what was it, Land, right? 3D Land was on uh, 3DS. We had, uh, what else was it? Um, New Super Mario Bros. 2, right? New Super Mario Bros. 2? Yeah, I think that's what it was. Uh, <clears throat> we had that, that was, that was a lot of fun. We had... Um, we had a lot of great, great games. I have my whole collection, but I cannot see it while I'm racing. It's across the room for me right now, so... I'm not, uh... I'm not gonna be able to see it. I'm trying to think off the top of my We had Animal Crossing, obviously. Uh, what was it? Um, New Leaf. That was a great game. That was a great game. Monster Hunter 4. Which a lot of people love Monster Hunter, right? It's like we... Oh my goodness gracious. Just like we have Rise on the Switch now. 
Uh, and we had... Oh, man. There was a lot of great games, though. Even, like, the non-first-party stuff. They were just fantastic. I miss that era, man. Oh, no! I got my stuff stolen. It's okay. We got more stuff. But yeah, let me know if you guys have uh, played the 3DS, and if so, what is your favorite 3DS game? What's your favorite 3DS game? For me, oh gosh, for me, hands down, Majora's Mask. There's not a question about it. That, that, that was just, man. I got the Majora's, oh. I almost got passed, I think. Um, <clears throat> I got the, I even got the Majora's Mask 3DS, man. That thing was so cool. So cool. We're back in first. I love, I love being able to, like, <clears throat> reminisce and talk about, you know, old school Nintendo memories with you guys in these videos. I don't know if you guys like those topics, but I just love to kind of go down memory lane. Rock Cup. This is from the Wii. <clears throat> Maple Treeway. Oh, gosh. Should we go down the Wii route? Because there's a lot I could say about the Wii. A lot of people didn't like the motion controls, but it was one of the greatest selling consoles of all time. You had, like, older people buying Wiis just for, like, who, who never gamed before. Just to, like, I guess for, I don't know, I guess a lot of people were, were getting for, like, movement. To stay, to stay moving. Exercise and all that. And, um, I don't know. Either way, it was a very popular console. Wii Sports was so great. It was so, so great, man. Um, there's just something about it. I'm glad that they brought Nintendo Switch Sports to the Switch. Even though I haven't played it as much as they would have liked to. <coughs> Just, uh, mostly because of health stuff. I haven't been feeling the greatest lately, but, uh, yeah, I don't know, man. Um, <coughs> excuse me. Um, the Wii. Twilight Princess came out. I remember playing it on the GameCube first, and it was, like, inverted. Everything was inverted, and I was like, huh. Uh, on the Wii, that is. When I, when I then played it on the Wii. That's what I meant to say. I beat it, like, so many times on the GameCube, then I got a Wii, and everything was, like, mirrored, man. And they had to do that because um, most people were like right-handed, so they made Link right-handed in the Wii version. And the easiest way to do that <clears throat> is just to mirror everything in the game. But obviously Link is typically a lefty, so the GameCube version, he was a lefty. So it was very interesting to replay the game in what was basically like a, a mirror mode. And uh, then I beat that a billion times as well. Uh, <laughs> oh, that, that became one of my fa that, that's the thing though. That became one of my favorite games of all time. Not one of, but like literally the favorite game of mine of all time. Um, then Skyward Sword came out, and like it was a lot of fun, but the motion controls were way more finicky on that one because they're more like precise, and you had to have that like motion plus or whatever. And so that was more finicky. So <clears throat> when um. Excuse me, when, when Skyward Sword HD got announced, I was really, really stoked because I'm like, dude, this is going to play way better. I knew that the gyro... Ah, oh gosh. I knew that the gyro in the... Um, in the Switch controllers would just function way better. I knew it, and I was right. It did. It functioned way better. Way, way, way better. And... Um, yeah, it was just great. Because that game had so much potential. I just love that game. Ah, oh, there we go. There we go. We got back into first. I don't know if we're going to remain in first. But anyways, uh, and then we had Super Mario Galaxy 1 and 2. Those games were like some of the greatest Mario games. I still prefer Sunshine. It's still my favorite one. I'm a Sunshine guy, yep. Yeah. That's, that's me. I love Sunshine so much, man. Just the vibe of that game. Just, ah, everything about it, man. I just love it. Love it. Ah, sucker. Dude, if I didn't have that banana, I would have been, like... I would have been in, in deep trouble. I would have got first place. But, yeah. <clears throat> I guess if you guys want to keep adding on to the comments section, you could also let me know what your favorite Wii game is <laughs> while we're at it. If you want to. <clears throat> have some interesting conversations. I always, I always love to hear what other people say, too. Right? I always tell people the reason I even started YouTube is because... I just love gaming. Did we already do four? No, we didn't. <clears throat> Did we? That felt like three. Well, we got we got the gold cup. Wait a minute, we got we got London. We got the boo. Uh, oh yeah, yeah, we did. Okay, yeah, we did four. We did four. All right. 
We did all four. I didn't even realize time flies, man, when you're having fun with your friends, just chatting about nostalgic stuff, you know? That's what we're doing here. So, anyways, guys, that is the Rock Cup in Mario Kart 8 Deluxe uh, Wave 2. Let me know what you guys think about it in the comments below, and I will see you guys very shortly with the second cup, which is the Moon Cup. I like to do it in different videos. Just like I said, if someone wants to see specifically the Rock Cup, then this is its own video, and same thing with the Moon Cup, whatever. If you guys want me to do in future waves to just compile it all into one video, let me know in the comment section. Otherwise, I'll see you in the next video. Thanks so much for watching, and until then, my friends, game on. See you guys soon.